In this video, we want to show something called data block search. When we create a program, if we look at the review screen for that program, we have all kinds of mill circles, mill frames, holes blocks, but we never really know which block did which feature. We certainly are able to highlight a block and then insert some notes here for for that particular block if we want to. So as we're going through the review screen, we can look for notes that may give us some indication of which feature that's being done on. But we can also use the graphics screen. If I go to the graphics here, we have a little button down here called select. If you're on an older control, it says data block search, but it exists on the Herco control. It has existed for many, many years. But here we have select. If I click on that select and highlight that, I can then go over using my cursor and simply click on a feature. I'm going to click on this frame around the outside of the block. Once I do that, I go over and I hit jump. And you'll see that it took me to the mill frame block that created that particular feature. So now I can make whatever edits I need to or do whatever I need to do in this block and know that that is the feature that I'm changing. If I go back to there, let's say I want to do something with these holes now. I can highlight select, go over and select on the hole, hit jump. Now it took me to block four, the bolt circle that did those particular holes. So I can use this feature to locate any of the features on the part within the program and then make whatever edits that I need without having to try to determine or remember which block did which feature on the part.